Hey everybody, Syntax here. Welcome to another episode on the Dungeons, Dragons, and Space Shuttles Patreon server. And I want to first start this episode wishing everybody out there all over the world happy holidays. Whatever you celebrate, I am just so excited that, uh, you know, today is here. It is for here in America. It's Christmas. And, you know, what an exciting time it is. And uh, so what do we got on today's episode? Well, we're going to be working a little bit on uh, automation and uh, making those farms that we've got, you know, that I've made. Uh, making them grow a little bit quicker. We're going to craft a couple things uh, to kind of help with that process. Um, and then also we might do one more episode this week and then we're going to be back on our normal schedule uh, due to the holidays, you know, spending time with family. And you know what, that's what it's all about this time of year. Um, and I just want to, you know, thank every single person out there that, you know, that watches this content and that supports me. You guys are awesome. And without you, you know, you're, you're my extended family. So you guys are making my holidays really great. So, okay. So uh, let's get going on the episode and see what we can come up with today. So, okay. Okay, so here we go. So I've got, uh, as you can see in between episodes, I've made one, another additional uh, plant interactor. So now I got three plant interactors. So I think what we're going to do, um, in order to speed up the production of these, uh, of these, uh, you know, the plants, they're doing a pretty good job. As you can see, I've got 331 um, inferior essence, but we can make this stuff go a little bit faster. And if we follow the quest line, we can uh, we can make the sprinkler right here. And uh, it does take a little bit. Um, as you see, it takes a bone block, which I think a bone block is simply just yeah, bones surrounded by a, uh, a hammer. Um, if we can craft this along with, I'm thinking the plant fertilizer right here. Um, this guy just takes basically bronze, um, some leather, uh, basic control circuit, and redstone. So nothing really too crazy. So we can produce all this stuff. Um, if we can set up each of these guys with this stuff, it should definitely speed up the uh, the production of the uh, of these farms. Um, the plant air, the uh, the plant fertilizer we're gonna have to supply with. I think we have to supply it with uh, fertilizer. Um, so there's any crops which we can do. Replanting through the lilies. Okay, so yeah, we can make this stuff. Okay, cool So if we can go ahead, let's get started and let's head back up to our workshop real quick And let's get started crafting this stuff up And I don't think it's gonna take too much because we got most of this most of the uh, the stuff required Okay All right, it's good to be back. You know, I've taken a couple days just to kind of you know relax You know spend some time with the family and then uh, I was playing a little bit of uh Elder Scrolls Online. I don't know if everybody out there plays that game, but I was playing a little bit just kind of getting, you know, reaccustomed to the game. Um, I really like it. It's kind of cool. Um, so I don't know if anybody wants to check it out, but if you check it, definitely check it out. Definitely Syntax recommends that game. So, okay. So here we go. So let's start with the, uh, we're going to start with the sprinkler first. So, okay. So we're going to need to get some gold plates. So let's grab some gold ingots real fast. As you see, we're running a little bit low on gold. Um, so we'll just go ahead and, oh, you know what? How do we make those guys... Can we put them in the compact? Oh, you know what? Was I not using the compactor? <laughs> I don't think I was. I think I might have been using the sawmill. <laughs> okay. So what happens when syntax goes away for a little bit? He forgets how to you know how to play the game. So okay. All right. So we got those going. We need some iron bars, which I think I got iron bars right here. And we're also going to need some iron rods. So let's grab these iron rods as well. And I think we also need. Let's see. So we're going to need silicon plates, which I don't think I have anymore. On my on my plates, no. Say so, so. We're gonna need to make four silicone plates. Which oh look at that! Wouldn't you know? I got five. Here we go. So we'll get those guys done. Get these guys cooking up. Um, we're also gonna need some methane gas, which I got four thousand or four you know four buckets of methane gas, pretty much. Um, and I think that should be enough. And let's grab all our bone. There we go. And we're gonna need to grab our hammer as well. Okay, so let's first make the bone blocks. So we're gonna need four. I think what is it? Four of these guys. One, two, three, four. Yep. Okay, so if we just take the bone and just surround it with the hammer, there we go. We should be able to get one, two, three, four bone blocks. That was a lot of bone. Good thing we've been killing a lot of skeletons, so we're gonna, we might have to get a farm set up, a mob farm set up. Might help with the, uh, you know, with the harvesting of stuff like this, especially if we're going to want to feed, you know, a, a plant fertilizer. We're going to need, you know, a good steady source of bones. So, okay. So let's drop this stuff down into the advanced crafting table. One, two, three, four. Two gold plates. We're also going to need... Let's see. We're also going to need... Okay. Oh, actually, you know what? It does not go in here. Okay, it's going to go into the blacksmith workshop. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, and then two gold plates. So we're going to need some iron bars, which I think they go... Okay, they go on the outskirts. So we're going to need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, let's grab our silicone plates. Drop these guys down as well. We're gonna need to put our hammer back. 
And let's see, our plates are going to go one, two, three, and four. And what was in the middle? It was, oh, it was just one simple water cell, which I think, do I have any extras? If not, we'll just grab one of these guys real quick. All right, here we go. Okay, so one water cell, bingo. And what was the other tool that we needed? So we needed the a bone spanner. I don't think I've made one of these guys yet. So it's basically just sticks and two kind of ingots. So let's just grab, let's grab, uh, I think we got the most, we got 10. 10 is the one we got the most. And let's see, one, two. And if we take these guys right here, there we go, our spanner. Okay, so if we drop this guy down real quick, we should be able to craft up one. What did we do wrong? Okay, let's see. Got, we have the burner, 12, let's see here. Everything looks, oh, you know what? We need to put our iron bars now. There we go. Okay, one sprinkler, so it says place over water in your crops. Okay, so let's go down and check out how this is gonna work. Okay, so if we hand, and look at what, let's collect our reward as well. More iron, more bone meal, cool. And some gold plates, which uh, we're gonna need them because we're gonna need to duplicate this two more times, at least on this side of the farm too. Uh, that way I wanna have all these farms kind of set up the same. And hopefully they do a pretty good job of, of uh, you know, speeding up production of crops. That way I can have... Whoa! Hello. <laughs> I fall through a hole that we have right there. There we go. Let's head back up real quick. All right. Let's try not to do that again. As you see, I'm prepping for the next stage of this episode, and I ended up falling right through the hole. <laughs> okay. It wouldn't be a video without me doing something crazy. So, okay. All right. So let's see. Let's take our little sprinkler, and I think maybe we can just put it... Oh. Is that how we do it? No. That's not how we do it. Okay, let's grab that again real quick. And I think, oh, you know what I think we're going to have to do is, okay. So I think what we got to do is this right here. So if we put this guy here like that, and we put our sprinkler down, we might have to pick up this stuff real quick. Okay, and like this. Okay, and I think our farm will be fine if we just now we need to grab some... Let's see, let's grab a bucket. There we go, and let's go grab some water real quick. There we go, and we can just go right over here to our nice little infinite water supports. So we'll come here. And I think this is how you gotta do it. Let's see. Always trying to figure stuff out on camera never sometimes works out the way it's supposed to. See, it's already turning right now real quick. Okay, now let's grab one more. If we come here. Okay. Definitely gonna have to get this area set up where I can walk up and down real quickly a lot better. So, okay, so if we drop this guy right here, and then we can maybe put, oop, not that. We'll go here, we'll just drop our, here and here. There we go. Okay, and then the nice little worm should, yeah, you go, put the thing. That's all we gotta do is replant our inferior seeds again. One and two, as you can see, the nice little animation there. So that should help out with speeding up. And I'm not sure if this hits all of it, what the radius is of this, but it looks like it's hitting them all. So, okay, so that should help with the, the speeding up of the uh, the inferior seeds. So, okay, so I like the way that turned out. Okay, so that is one way we can do it. Now let's look into also crafting up this plant fertilizer as well. We're gonna throw this guy right here and I think we're gonna end up moving all these uh, these basic drawers right here, um, we're gonna put them downstairs. I think all the, the you know the outputs of these farms we're gonna have down here in kind of our little bottom area right here. So okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get everything kind of set up, and then we're gonna come back, and then we'll continue on crafting um, the uh, the little you know enhancements to these farms. Okay, be right back. Okay, we're back and let's see what we can do about crafting up this uh, plant fertilizer. So what we need is, let's go back to uh, plant fertilizer. Plant. Here we go. So we need we need bronze plates, which I got cooking up right now. I've got our eight bronze plates. I also have our two pieces of plastic. So let's get this stuff down real quick. And I think, where do we put this? Do we put this into the advanced crafting table? Yes, we do. Okay, so eight of these guys. There we go. And we're gonna need also Three leather, which wouldn't you know, I grabbed it right ahead. I got, you know, did a little bit of planning. So we got three leather. We're going to need two plastic. We're going to need some iron gears as well, which I think iron gears are simply 
Yeah, okay, so we're gonna need eight iron, which we're doing okay. I've got quite a bit of resources, so let's get eight of these guys real quick. One redstone. Got tons of redstone, so okay. And move tiny rubber. Okay, one, two, one, one, two, one, two, one, two. And what did I, did I not grab enough? I must not have. Oh, no, actually, it kind of lagged a little bit. There we go. Okay, so two iron ingots. We're also gonna need, okay, so we're gonna need one redstone. We're gonna need some iron plates. So let's grab, that's one thing I didn't need. Let's grab eight more iron ingots. We'll make these iron plates real fast. It should only take a second. And we're also gonna, let's drop down this redstone. And also a basic control, or control circuit, which I got right here. And let's throw this in here. So all basically we're waiting on is just the iron plates real quick, which those guys should take a couple seconds. And uh, I grabbed our solar panel uh, tier three real quick uh, from down here because what I'm gonna do, and we'll kind of show you guys while, uh, while those are cooking up, is um, I wanna set these guys up the same way that these guys are set up the, uh, you know, on my plant interactors. But for the time being, I don't wanna, you know, on camera craft a whole bunch of stuff that I've already made before. Um, so what we'll do is, what we'll do is we'll, we'll drop the, uh, okay, where are you coming from? I hate these guys. That's what I think about my little island is, it seems like it's it's constantly overrun by slimers. There they are. Hey, buddy. Okay, go away. See, I'm trying to work here. You gonna give me anything nice other than the experience? Okay. Um, I'm gonna drop down, so I'm gonna run some power down to here, down underneath to my power you know, source down here with my uh, water wheels. But we're gonna go ahead and, like I said, we're gonna move this guy right here real quick. And let's just, for the time being, drop one piece of dirt right there real quick and let's home back real fast and our we should those plates should be done by now hopefully as you can see there we go and we are yep there we go killed a little bit of time okay so if we drop these guys down real fast we should get us one plant fertilizer there we go and you know while we're doing this let's grab let's grab a bone meal that we do have which is right here, we got 10, so I'm gonna have to do something definitely to get a lot more bone meal because what I have in mind is gonna take a bunch of resources to actually run correctly the whole time. But if it's all done right, it should net us a huge, you know, gains as far as, uh, you know, all the plants that we grow in this nice little area. And I'm gonna have to obviously have to do a little bit more duplication because uh, I have to craft the same things on each of these little, you know, basins. So it's gonna take a huge amount of resources, but you know what? That's why we're here, man. We're here to, uh, to grind, we're here to get stuff done, so there we go. So there is one plant fertilizer. Oh, you know one thing we're going to have to do too as well? Actually, you know what? Why, I don't know why I put it on this one. So, okay, let's get rid of that real quick. Let's move this drawer controller real fast. I know we're going to be breaking this real quick, but that's fine. Uh, let's drop one piece of dirt. And we'll throw the plant fertilizer right here. So this is the farm that I want. So not only are we going to get the bonus from this guy, we're also going to get the bonus from this guy too as well. I think we just feed this guy bone meal. But as you see, he's got no power. And one thing I did not take account for is that I don't think this is going to generate power. Well, you know, solar power right now, it's, you know, it's not going to run from solar. So let's actually move it for just the time being so I can demonstrate what's going to happen. Put it right here. This is not where it's going to go permanently, but just for the time being, we'll throw this guy right here. Now this should get power now. There we go. So it starts to generate a little bit of power. As you can see, it's already starting to run. So, okay. But what we can do is, if we just drop bone meal in here real fast, bingo, it should feed this, so it's only gonna have a one by one because we don't have the range add on in it right now. But um, it's gonna give us a nice little double bonus of you know growing, so okay. So I do like the way that looks. So that's kind of what I'm gonna do. And uh, in between episodes, what I'll do is I'll, I'll run some of the, the energy relays in here. We'll get enough power fed into this guy um, as it's gonna take quite a bit of power to run this correctly. But if all goes as well, and you know what we can do real quick is let's hook this guy back up. It should generate us quite a bit of, here we go, of uh, resources. It's only going to make this stuff run a little bit faster, so. Okay, so what I'm going to do now for the rest of this episode is now that this is kind of the idea of how we're going to speed up this farm, um, I want to go downstairs and I want to reroute how all this stuff uh, is going, how we're going to store it. So, okay, so let me get a game plan together and I'm going to come back and I'll show you guys how we're going to reroute this. Okay, be back in one second. Okay, so the first step what we're going to need to do if we're going to start rerouting all that, uh, all the stuff from the farm is we need to make some more item decks. So I've got six, but we're going to need a little bit more. Um, it's not too crazy to craft an item deck. So we just need, we need two, it looks like we need uh, four tin plates, some electrotene and some glass. So nothing too crazy and I think I've got... 
Two electrotine. We need to get some tin ingots. Let's also double check to make sure I don't have any tin ingots right here. Okay, I got one electrotine. So we want to be, you know, save as much as we can. Well, I don't want to do that though. Okay, let's put this back where it goes. Try to stay organized, syntax. Here we go. Okay, so let's drop one of these guys in real fast. And then we're also gonna need some glass. And I think I got glass in here. One, two, three. Okay, and we'll simply just craft up. Here we go. And we're gonna need one of these guys, and then we'll just swap that out for the tin. Okay, and I think it was silicon is what we needed for this stuff. Yep, so we need two buckets, and what did you know? Got it all ready to go. All right, one, two buckets of silicon, and we'll, we'll sort the tools in a second here. Let's see, so we got, well, actually, no, we'll do it right now. So the tools that we need is we need the hammer, cutter, and gem cutter, okay. So I think I've got my hammer, cutter, uh, where is my gem cutter? Oh, there's that, I might not have a gem cutter. Um, unless I have it over here, maybe? Let's see. I think we might have to make one more of those guys real fast. Okay. What did it take to make the gym cutter? I want to say it was, okay, just two, okay, it's one string. Nothing too crazy, so one stick. We're going to need two ingots. We'll just go ahead and continue to use all our tin, since tin is what we've got the most of. And then we need just one string. Here we go. And that should net us a gym cutter. There we go. Perfect, and if we drop that guy in here real fast, there we go, and now these plates should be done. Bingo, and if we drop these guys all the way around, we should be able to craft up, there we go, eight more item decks, so, okay. So, let's get rid of some stuff real quick. Don't need this chiseled stone, dirt, and we can always make more dry rubber. Okay, let's drop the rest of the stuff back. We can get rid of these cells and the, oop, didn't want to do that. Um, need our bow um, and the the, uh, the glass as well. Okay, so let's head downstairs real quick and uh, we'll finish up the writing of, of the uh, of all these inferium and then in between episodes in between I'll uh, I'll finish up kind of duplicating the process and then I'll I'm gonna do a little bit of work downstairs here designing this area down here because it's just uh, as if you can notice uh, since the last episode I've done a little bit of nice little work here uh, lighting up the area. I'm gonna finish up the back side over here um, this is going to be kind of um, not only just for farming, but this is going to be my main power generation room um, as I've got some pretty cool ideas for the actual main base that I'm going to be building. Um, and I'm going to leave that probably for my, uh, my New Year's, you know, surprise for you guys to kind of see how I'm going to design my new base. Um, but I, what I've got, you know, what I'm going to do is pretty, pretty cool. I find, you know, I'm going to say. So, okay. Here we go. We're going to actually, I shouldn't have got rid of some of that stuff. We're going to need to climb up here real quick. Okay. So let's see here. We need to go connect this item deck right here. And we'll just simply just go item deck here, here, and then we'll run it. I think we need to go one more down here. Yep. And we're going to run it straight across. Actually, you know what? One second. Um, hmm. I think, oh, actually, you know what? We can go right here. We go all the way here, and then we're going to run it down to right here. And I think we're going to feed the controller right. I think this is where we want it. Right here. Nope. I want to feed the controller right here, like this. Because I want to connect all my drawers right here, like this. Okay. And we can put it correctly. Come on. No, I would have used the axe. It would have been better. Actually, you know, I think I have an axe. There we go. There we go. Okay. Um, I think I have to, in order to do this correctly, I have to stack it like this. And then we can put the uh, drawer like this guy right here. Bingo. Okay. So that should feed there. So what we should be able to do is, if we head back up real quick, that is, should have solved the issue. Um, let's head back upstairs real quick. Actually, no one can sleep real quick. And bingo. Okay, so let's see. Let's just double check to make sure everything's working as as designed. Okay. Okay, so we don't have this hooked up yet, so we should be drawing out. As you can see, all the Ethereum that's collected is already gone. So we should have all of the Inferium headed downstairs. So let's just go ahead and grab all this stuff real quick that we've currently got. And uh, we'll, you know, we'll leave those seeds right there. And you know what? We'll just fall. Take a little bit of fall damage. As you can see already right here, the, uh, the Inferium has already ended up where it's supposed to go. So, okay. 
So very cool. So that is actually, as you say, we got 400 now. Um, that is doing the job. So what we're going to do, and I'm going to have all of the farms rerouted here. So everything that grows is going to be put on this wall over here. Um, and like I said, this is gonna, this room is going to be used for uh, power generation. But I need to do a little bit more designing as I think I'm going to start using... Uh, we're going to get into canola a little bit, but okay, but that is kind of the design what I'm going to do with these farms, how I'm going to automate the process and start collecting and uh, how we can speed up the process of the farming. So I think I accomplished both of those goals today. So, okay. So what I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap the episode up right here, killing this, you know, this little skeleton over here in the corner. And uh, when we come back, I'll have all this stuff designed. So, okay. So please drop down, subscribe to the channel, uh, leave a comment, like the video, and I hope all of you have a great Christmas and uh, we will have a lot more fun, not only just, you know, in the coming weeks, but next year as far as for planning, continuing, expanding. And I think this is a little hint, hint. This is where I'm going to build the main base right here. So, okay. So we'll see you guys on the next episode of Dungeons, Dragons, and Space Shows. All right. Take care. Everybody.